sir, welcome to a different video normally. So, we have these homo supports here, and they all have these things. So basically, they've made some quality of life changes to save the world. Means that the game is going to be a little bit different, and these changes mostly apply to high end Canny Valley. High end Twine Peaks, early Stonewood and Mike's and let's just read. So the first one is Director Riggs. He is saying that crafting materials will now stack up to 999 instead of 200. This is good because it means we can have less space in our inventory that's used up for crafting materials and more space that can be used up for weapons and traps. So basically that's a really good one. Next one is clips in her corner apparently. Traps and crafting materials are no longer requiring new materials for crafting. This means that legendary items will now cost the same items to craft as common. I don't know if that means we need the exact same materials if the number is the same. And then we have Major's Desk. We're getting reports that a nurse cusk, healing is less affected and husks are doing less damage to structures behind Twine Peaks. Okay, so high end Twine Peaks has now been alert. Okay. I don't know why this just says alert, but I'm going to keep my eye on that. And so apparently in high end wait, was that V-Bucks? Sorry, I'm interrupting. But I swear I just saw V-Bucks. No, that's just me. Okay. So in high end twine peaks, which is around here, starting around here. They should be doing less damage to structures now, and also husks are going to do more damage. Next thing I've also been, well, it's been shown is that in our backpack we'll be able to store items up to 999. Right now, it's not really changed. No, I don't want to destroy it. Right, I have no idea what I've done here. I'm going to sub but okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into a private game. I'm saying I'm going to go into a private game. Um, I'll go into here. Yeah, why not? Oh wait, wait, wait! Whoa, 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 whoa! whoa. Yeah, I want to find an empty. Oh yeah, we're in a private. We're good. We're good. We're good. Also, apparently there'll be a new war games coming as well. But the main thing that's important is the 999 crafting materials that they've discovered with the weapon efficiencies. I have no idea why it's just saying alert. Like, what? Uh, if we're doing this, I'd probably recommend like a private game. So that nobody steals your materials while you're getting them sorted. Right now, they seem to still be in stacks of 200, which might mean that some stacks of 200 will be considered um, rare. So I might just keep two stacks. I might just keep like a stack of 200 because if they're gonna keep it at 200, if they're gonna keep it at 999 now, then the 200 is gonna be non-existent. So I'm gonna keep at least. I'm gonna probably keep a stack of rough war or something that I have a lot of. Opportunity to strike an approaching horde. Get okay. ready for a fight. Also, we've got ten minutes to take out as many husks as possible. If you bag enough husks, we win. If you don't, we don't. Don't forget to collect those husk and mist monster samples. Strike hard, strike fast, strike fear into the heart of the horde. Don't forget, the storm is closing in, so watch the map. Alright, so let's get a... We've got updated this. objectives! We've got creepers husking all over the place, but keep an eye out for encampments. Right. So, Ray was talking there. But as you can see, there's the crafting options. The material amount is changed. The material needed is changed. But the material amount itself is kept the same. Also, I'm at 200 because, um... Yeah, I got two of them. I know I should have gotten it a long time ago, but I forgot to. So it gave me 10 extra backpack slots, which was really nice. Oh, is this one my daily story? If it is, then yeah, I'll do this again later. Okay.
Okay, so the first thing I've heard is that you no longer will be able to get grey, green and blue weapons at the end of Twine. I think at the beginning of Plankton, I think at like the mid Plankton, you'll stop getting greys. And then early Twine, you'll stop getting greens. And then high out Twine, you'll stop, you'll stop getting blues from yours. So it means when you're about at the end of the game, chess will only give you epic and legendary guns. Which means that you won't really have these green and blue guns. I think if you go back though, you should be able to obtain them. Again, if you go back to um, old places like Stonewood. But anyway, I want to see if this is true. So we got some rusted and handy parts here. We got four of them. Yeah, they do. They stack up. There we go. Now they're in one slot. So let's do it again. Yeah, they're in one slot. Okay. Eight hundred. Get it up. Eight hundred right there, and it's taking up less inventory space as well, which is always nice. Does it mean there's more stuff to craft in? Okay, let's drop the in here. Right up. Sorry for the loud music, I can't hear really anything about that. Alright. There we go, this is a very nice upgrade. Upgrade, I mean. As it means I get more inventory. Another thing is, I normally found these bacon in toilets. <laughs> I know, weird flex, I found the bacon in toilet. Hey, I don't know. Those are little passes. Okay. Well, let's get out of here. Oh, hold on. Nothing. I wanna get inside here. I don't want to make up the house. So I'll get over here. Why not? As long as there are no houses up there. Okay, we seem to be good. Alright, now let's back up some other stuff. Wait, I had a stack of 200 of what? Okay, cause, okay, I'm gonna, like, put a screenshot of that up, but I had a stack of 200 of one. And by the way, the update only just dropped today while I'm making this video, so that was a bug. That was not supposed to happen. But now you can have it actually happen in the game. Stacks of over 200. Look, I have a stack of 200 of one. Oh, am I getting them? I think I'm getting them. Okay, that's not a bug. That's just a... Um, the upgrade. Okay. There we go. Look, I had like... Okay, so let's count how many stacks I have. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 14. Okay, so let's just say 13 and a half because I have over 100. 13 and a half. Let's just say 13 and a half. Let's get rid of all of this. We had 13 and a half before. I want to see how many spaces we have now. So we had 14 things taken up. Now we only have three. That is a big increase. Now, um, I think that the um, things, the 200 stacks are still possible. They're just going to be, um, You'll need exactly 200, so 200 stacks is still possible, so I won't need it. Why did I drop my bundle bus? Why did I drop my bundle bus? <laughs> okay, that was weird. But anyway, as you can see, I managed to save up lots of spaces in my inventory now. Oh, I still got it. Five minutes left! Storm's closing in! Alright, Ray. Don't care. As you can see, everything is now the same. I don't know why these are the only two materials you can craft. So yeah. Today's update was very good for Save the World. We managed to get a lot of stuff, a lot of balance changes. And on top of that, it's going to be easier to level up. Because now we don't have to worry about um, things being annoying and throwing up our inventory. Am I going to get superpowers? No, buddy. Also, we should be seeing the return of some missions. I don't know what this is Should be seeing the
return of some heroes and defenders. Like, maybe we'll be getting Val back. Val's the rarest defender in the game. But yeah, other than that, that's really it, so. You're good at liking and subscribe. If you actually want to see more Save the World content on here, because I don't normally post I don't normally post Save the World, and I normally, when I upload Fortnite, it's normally either creative or battle royale, or the showcase for gamers. Yeah, but other than that, I'll see you guys later.